Using the Paint Ready sprayer is simple, and the integrated spray controls let you adjust the material volume, spray width, and spray shape to achieve your desired results. For thicker materials, start with the highest flow setting and then dial down to suit your spraying needs. The higher the flow setting, the quicker you will have to work in order to avoid sags caused by too much material. Start with a clean paint surface to avoid blowing dust on your freshly sprayed surface. Begin by partially pulling the trigger on the gun to start the turbine. Next, pull back on the trigger completely to start spraying. Point the sprayer 6 to 12 inches away from the surface as you begin to spray evenly in a direction parallel to the surface. Remember to keep your arms straight as you spray. Bending your wrists or slowing your pace tends to leave too much paint in one spot. Remember, always keep moving continuously while spraying. If your surface area is larger, overlapping each spray pass by 50% will ensure full coverage. Apply a thin first coat and allow the painted area to dry before applying a second, slightly heavier coat. The adjustment ring on your Paint Ready sprayer determines the width and shape of the spray pattern. You can adjust the spray pattern shape by moving the air cap to either the horizontal or vertical positions. And the red spray switch can select between narrower round patterns or a wide pattern. To spray up and down along the surface, select a horizontal spray pattern. For side-to-side -side spraying, select a vertical pattern. If your surface is smaller, such as a corner or spindle, a lower volume and narrower pattern on the sprayer works best. And thanks to the patented lock-and-go design, you can change colors or materials in a flash with a twist of the sprayer and release of the cup.